You know, I gotta say, running at night, it's pretty nice. It's like weirdly relaxing. All right, runs over 11.46 miles in an hour 40, 840 pace. Pretty good for being tired and a little run down, sleep deprived. I like running at night. It's like, it's like relaxing. Like it just feels calmer. Anyways, I'm gonna go eat and sleep for 12 hours now. All right, what's up? It's Tuesday morning. My legs are cooked from that run yesterday. Um, but we're we're gonna hop on the bike. But first, making a little goat meal. There's like none left. This is probably gonna turn out watery as fuck because I think I have too much water. Yeah, that was definitely not gonna be good. A little bit of a late start. It's 8.36 a.m. So I'm a little behind. So I gotta slam these oats and then pop right under the saddle because then I gotta go straight to the old podcast. <laughs> Slept like a baby last night, like a little baby deer, like Bambi. We got a run later today too, but my legs are, I mean, I think I'll be able to do it, but they're sore. Like my calves are sore, which is weird. Hey buddy. Hi Buster. Bada bing. What were you shouting about? There's no oats left. Half a cup left, and I put a cup of water, which is gonna be too much, so I think these oats are gonna be like oat soup. I'm gonna be drinking these oats. Yes. Give, give, give me them. What? Give me them. How is that not <laughs> the men ever make it on their own? Rolled oats, entire thing filled. I didn't know I was supposed to check the containers. Too late now. All right, we got some liquidy oats. Some blueberries. Syrup and shrimp. Yeah. Actually, doesn't look that bad. These. Cody's bad oats. All right, this is definitely the hardest ride I've done yet. It's been nonstop. Super heavy wattage. Oh, it sucks. 20 minutes left, too. We got five minutes at 210 watts. Three minutes at 170, then minute at 215, 220, 225, 225, 230. No breaks. Fuck. Gotta do it. God damn. It. One more minute. I gotta, I can't feel it. Come on. Ah! Oh, we're done. Ah! Fuck. I'm supposed to be going at 170 right now, but I can't. I did. I'm cooked. Hurry right, we're back in. What the fuck kind of warm down is 170? What the fuck is that? That's not a, it's mean. That's just mean. That was like uh, literally the hardest workout I've done in, I can, in the years. I'm hurting, man. <coughs> now I gotta go podcast for three hours. <coughs> I'm still pouring sweat. <laughs> One of the hardest workouts I think I've ever done in my life. I don't know, cause the, the bikes up until now have been not easy, but like nothing close to that. So I was kind of looking forward to like, ah, oh, sitting down and just kind of grinding it out for an hour, you know? But at like somewhat of a leisurely pace. But man, that, that was, that was hard. I really hope that I see some quote unquote gains soon on the bike. Like I'd like to retest my FTP soon, I think. Maybe I'll do that next week and we'll see if I've moved up at all. I'm like, I see him double. I think it's because I put two sets of contacts in this morning by accident, but still. Oh man, I look bad. Sheesh, a Reno. Anyways, I gotta go do the podcast. So, some more work stuff. So, I gotta go through my email. Thing is, I, I like making videos so much that that's all I do is make new shit and focus on making new shit. Like I have a hundred emails right now, just like administrative shit that I have to, I need a fucking assistant, man. That's what I need. Okay, bye. It's 5 p.m., time for a little run. We got four minute builds today. So it's like just 30 minutes of running, but it's like four minutes at 8.50 and then four minutes at 8.30 and then four minutes at seven and then four minutes at 7.45 and then four minutes at 7.30 or something like that. So I don't know, we'll see how this one feels. I'm kind of excited, honestly. I just, I like running in the evenings to be H with you guys. If I'm really Hing with you guys, I do like to run in the evenings. Um, better, I don't know, it's just the energy is a little bit better. So uh, my legs are really sore from yesterday's 11 and a half mile run and sore from still like standing on them and dancing all weekend. So 
we'll see how this feels. Whew. Just finished the intervals. Didn't feel as strong as I thought I was going to. I think I should have ate something before I left. That's okay. Sun setting is nice. I'm doing a little cool down now. I think I'm gonna make a poke bowl. Okay, it's Wednesday. Uh, Kelsey and I are in Palm Springs. We left at like 8 a.m. so I was supposed to wake up and do the old ocean swim, you know, that you see me do every Wednesday. It was thundering and lightning out and I woke up, I was so fucking tired, so tired. And I was, I just like, didn't want to do it. I pussied out, I pussied out. I used the thunder and the lightning as an excuse, even though I think they still did the swim because I think it was over by the time that it started. I wish I could sit here and tell you all, it's all, you know, grind no matter what, do it no matter what. But sometimes, sometimes I pussy out, you know? And today was one of those days. Oh, the lightning, look at the lightning. I'm going back to sleep. <clears throat> Slept my ass off too. I had the best fucking sleep in ever. Made me feel so good. And now we're in Palm Springs and I found a pool. Palm Desert Aquatic Center. So I'm just gonna go rip some laps. Haven't done that in a minute. So that should be fun. I guess. Well, actually, no, it'll be probably the most boring thing on earth because swimming laps kind of is, but I'm weirdly excited for it. I like swimming laps, so I'll see you in there. All right, that was good. I did uh, 45 minutes, 2,850 yards. I wanted to do 3,000, but I got kicked out because all the lanes were closed. Kind of sucks that I was 150 yards away, but whatever. It's not the most beautiful parking lot you've ever seen. Look at this shit. Look how big it is, too. Just single spots divided by palm trees. Bougie. I mean, that pool was phenomenal. I would come here every single day if I lived here. Well, not every day. I wouldn't swim every day. No, I wouldn't do that. Why did I say that? I would not do that. But I would come here all the time. Man, post-swim is just not a good look. And this just like lasts. It's like lasts for hours afterwards. So that's a fun side effect. You just look like you haven't slept in months. I mean, I am just floored by the beauty of this parking lot. You you don't, you just, it, it's, it's really hard to put into words. I mean, parking lots are usually so shitty. Look at this. It's just, and don't, this is not like a boomer thing. It's anyone of any age can appreciate a good parking lot. Look, at it just keeps going. Just infinite spots to park, infinite room to open up your door. Am I, am I flipping out for no reason? This is, look at this. It looks like a national fucking park. I love it. Fuck, you did good. Whoever made this shit, whoever made this, you did good. Morning, it's Thursday, still in Palm Springs. Time for a little Renz Gadoosh. Sun is not up yet, it's gonna be nice. It's gonna be very nice. I think I'm gonna take it slow. My legs are sore. Look at this. Stunning, stunning. The inside of my knee really hurts. Like right here, it keeps like popping. Oh fuck, that feels awful. Fuck, man. I'm just gonna warm up slower. Hmm. This is a shitty feeling. It's the worst. Not feeling strong when you start a run. Like feeling some weird pain. Ugh. All right, well, seems to be fine. Seems to be fine when I run slow like this, so maybe we'll just keep going slow. Oh yeah. Getting a little stretch on. Woo! Getting these hammies nice and creamy. I don't usually stretch, like, at all. So, this is a little change of pace for me, but maybe that's what the issue is, you know? Ow. Here we are. Enjoy the view, guys. <laughs> Feels a little better. So I'm just gonna keep going. Hopefully I won't regret that. Finished it. A little slow due to the leg, but it kind of stopped hurting as I started running, so. I ended up doing 7.6 miles at like 9.18, so. Whatever, slow, but slow for me, right now at least. So the one thing I hope is that I did not like, you know when you're, you get a pain in your legs, you start running different and then that's how you injure yourself? I really hope I'm not doing that, we'll see. Oh man, just got a little massage. I love massages, I really do. I got a 60 minute massage but I fell asleep for the whole first 60 minutes. So then I asked her to extend to 80 minutes because I was like, I didn't, I didn't feel any of that. I just, I was sleeping the whole time. <laughs> I literally go there so I can take a nap. I paid a nap. 
How sad is that? It's like the ultimate form of relaxation for me is that a massage nap. It's great. And she really worked my legs too. I asked her to like go in on my legs because I mean, I got to take care of these puppies and they've just been feeling so not right. So that's good. A little bit of self care. You know, it's, a, it's an important part of training. Fuck, man. How am I supposed to do anything? I'm supposed to do a bunch more work. I'm supposed to like film and stuff. And I'm like 20% awake. Nah, I feel, I feel good. Woo, let's go. Let's go. Woo. Dinner tonight. Another salmon bowl. <laughs> Thumbs up for mercury poisoning, probably. Salt, pepper, garlic powder, chili powder. Skirt, skirt, skirt. 20, Kelsey likes it well done, so we do 22 minutes. All right, we got the salmon and there with the rice. This avocado is perfect. We got half of that and then I'm, return of the Maggie sauce, which I said was from, what did I say? What did I say, it was soy sauce? And it's, it, says, it says imported from Europe right here on the front of the bottle. What do you think of that? Me? Yeah. Funny. Monosodium glutamate, MSG, baby. Oh yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I really do be farting. Oh my god. Incredible. Maggot sauce. <laughs> Chopped up maggots. That's the secret ingredient. It's not only MSG, <laughs> it's maggots. You went a little bit more Asian with yours. You did that. Rice vinegar and some sriracha. Mm. And I'm gonna put sesame oil on my rice. Sesame oil. I mean, this is the best meal. Mm. You gotta start doing the rice. I'm a minimalist. You're lazy. Oh yeah, that's what it is. When, you're not lazy. When it comes to food, you like to eat as fast as you possibly can. Yeah. Get the food to you as fast as you can in yeah. your mouth. Yeah. So adding the two extra steps of putting shit on the rice is a waste of time. Oh, I ate too fast. Stuck right here. Exactly. <laughs> oh my god, are you okay? Yeah, it's just stuck right here. Okay. No, nope, just went down. We're good. Crisis averted. So, anyways, like I was saying, I am patient. <laughs> Anything to say? Come on. Everyone's asking. Everyone's been saying. So, what do you have to say? Finished. Wow. We did it. Mmm. I see me good. Kind of bloody ears I didn't get any. Mm -hmm. So good. Alright, thanks for joining us for Din. Folks! Just finished the music video for Knock It Off Space Rangers Remix. Now I'm going to the pool to get a little swim in. It's a rest day for the legs still. The swimming, do you use legs in swimming? I mean, I kick them, but like, doesn't really feel like that does, that does much, you know? I don't know, I just, I need to, I wanna get some sort of workout in. I'm not gonna run tomorrow either, I'm gonna do a long ride tomorrow. Hopefully that feels fine, and then Sunday, I'm gonna try and do a long run, so hopefully my legs are all good by then. We'll see. All right, off to the pool. Just doing a little stretch in. Enjoy the view, folks. Zah. Yeah, I just did 3,000 yards. Did you warm up for our swim? Yeah, yeah, cool. Let's get another couple miles, probably. <laughs> 3,000 yards, 131 per 100. Longest and fastest swim yet. Big one. What do you guys, yeah, how'd you guys feel? Yeah, never want to do that again. <laughs> I love this, that like after a swim, you just have this for like three hours. <laughs> I got a goddamn ticket. We didn't. You guys didn't get a ticket? I don't have a part, brother. Fuck, I just parked it in the middle of the street. That's probably why. Yeah, it could've been that. <laughs> All right, I did do my longest swim. Hold on. Oh, sorry about that. I did do my longest and fastest swim today, so I'm treating myself. There's a Yeasty Boys truck on Abbey Kenny, so I got that. And I got a little blue bottle, just loaded with cream and sugar. <laughs> hey man, you guys are all saying, you need more carbs, you need more carbs. So I don't need more carbs. Look at that shit, hold on. Look at that cross section. Let's see if I can get some sun on it. Sheesh. Sheesh. Should we just do a bite in the car right now? What a horrible view. All right, guys, time to review, time for my review of the Yeasty Boys bagel. It's kind of artsy. Oh, by the way, 
a lot of people have been asking for one of these, so I'm just gonna give it to you. Mm, tastes like piss. It's a little throwback to my old vlogging days. Mm. Oh! Yo! I've been into screaming these days. I mean, this is really fantastic. The bagel itself is incredible. Look at that, that's an everything bagel. This is everything to me right now. Yo! Wow. Wow. I gotta be honest. There's a lot of people around the Yeasty Boys. I was like, what's the big deal? You guys are all here because it's got a clever name. Yeasty Boys. This lives up to the hype. This is really, really good. All right, now I got um, I got a few meetings and I'm gonna film three videos and then I try and get a haircut and then busy day. So let's, let's get it. I don't know what this is supposed to be, but it's avocado on toast with salt and hot honey. I'm, I'm, I'm hot honey. Yeah, you are. Welcome. I hate that. <laughs> I actually hate that that's on film. All right, folks, it's Saturday. Long ride day. I gotta fuel up. So I'm gonna make some oatmeal, some goat meal. Yes. Yes. Probably gonna have one of those too. Hmm. It's raining. Came outside to get my bike, and it's raining. Guess I'm gonna have to do it indoors then. Ah, that sucks. Two hours. That fucking blows. Fuck. Well, we gotta do it. At least these are getting a little wash. <laughs> hey, got the bibs on. Ah, still no fan. It arrives by 10 p.m. today. That would have been nice to get yesterday. But you can fully expect when I set that sucker up, you're getting some sort of biggest fan joke. You know, something along those lines. I'll think about it a little bit more, but you know, you're, you're getting a joke. So look forward to that. Oh, I met, met my new biggest fan. That's a little preview. So it's, it'll be better than that. The cool thing about the bike inside is that you can get a little shit done. Sometimes I call my mom. Today I just watched the newest cody trains and left some notes for the editor tyler shout out tyler he's doing a great job by the way with this channel sound off in the comments give a little props to tyler great editing i've been really enjoying it how redundant is that though wait you're training and watching the last train this video trainception choo choo -ception. just some more jokes for you guys i mean like full of them today so we're 22 minutes into this ride which means we have an hour and 40 minutes left Yes! So, okay. Well, uh, uh, check in with you later. Bye. All right, three minutes left. Been going for an hour, 57 minutes. Man, if you need inspiration when you're working out, watch the Redeem Team documentary. Whew. Watch any athletic documentary about working hard. It's the key. Workout hack. Morning. Happy Sunday. Half marathon fuel in the bowl. Doing a two hour run. My legs are hopefully rested and fresh. So I'm gonna try and go for like 8.30 pace, which would mean a sub two hour half marathon. Put me in around, around 14 miles in two hours or 15 miles or something like that. It's gonna be a long one. I'm carbon up right now. It's a little oatmeal granola, frozen bloobs, and get the fuck off. Oatmeal granola, frozen blueberries, and maple syrup, and some coffee. I'm gonna load up on this and get ready. So funny. I'm like two miles into this. If this was a normal run, I'd be fine. Like, it's just a two hour run. But like, because I'm, I wanna do a fast half marathon, I wanna perform well. Now I'm like hyper aware of like every little pain in my body. I got a little blister on my heel. And I'm like, oh fuck, what if that starts hurting more? I'm like feeling pains in my groin. I'm like, what if that's from the bike? I'm feeling pains in my rear upper duodenum. I'm like, I don't even know where that is, but it hurts probably. Mental game, you know, relax. Everything's good. I'm running at eight minute mile pace right now. Like it's nothing. You got this, okay? This is a message for you. Me, not you watching you. Who I'm staring at right now. You got it. Let's go. Look at this. Yes. Sun's rising. 
I might be a little high. I'm fucking rolling, you guys. <laughs> what if that's what you did on runner's high? <laughs> Someone have water? Someone have a cigarette? All right, new half marathon record. I'm pretty sure it's my fastest one ever. I was trying to look up my old results, but I think today's was the fastest. 7.51 pace for all 13.1 miles. It's, it's, I'm gonna clean it. It's sweat. <laughs> I hung my shirt on the chair after, so there's a puddle of sweat on the ground. <laughs> Kelsey hates sweat. She thinks it's the grossest thing in the entire world. So it went really well. It felt like super strong and fast. 1.42, I think was the time. There's the stats right there. But anyways, and then I ran two more miles after to get the full two hours. So I think in total I did 13, 13 point or 15.1 miles. Anyways, I'm eating this horrendous, I don't even, I don't think, this looks horrible. Are you that bummed about this what? Yeah, I'm disgusted. But like as soon as a paper towel, it's gone. I know, but it's just like, take it off outside. Don't hang it up on our dining room chair. Like, are you kidding? Well, I'm like soaking wet, I have to take it off. But you know what? You ran, you did it, and I'm so proud of you. Thank you. Good end to a good week. Did a lot of training this week. Like, even though I took a couple of rest days from running, I still am at 38 miles for the week. It feels like a lot. But my legs felt good today. There was that little bit of that popping, but like not really that much. And once I warmed up, I couldn't feel it. So that's a good sign. Anyways, cheers. Good week. Thanks for watching. Appreciate it. Love you guys. We'll see you next week. Remember to hop on board. Choo. Train. Choo choo! And here, we'll just end with a nice little static shot here of the sweat.